And the northern part of the state is seeing a real messy mix out there right now. Storm Team 8 meteorologist Sam Cantrell live tonight in the Mobile Weather Lab with a look at the conditions. Sam, what are you seeing out there? Well, it has been a really rough day for a lot of people across Connecticut and especially in the northern half of the state. We're going to check in with Mario in a minute, but where we are here, which is out in Waterbury, it has been bad all day long from Waterbury. We drove from New Haven up towards Waterbury all the way across from Hartford down to Meriden, across to Middletown and everywhere over there. The temperature was hovering at and slightly below freezing. As a result of that, I'd love to show you what things look like on a roof camera. I can show you the back of the vehicle, but I, it won't spin around because it's completely frozen solid. So it was really icy and it was really dangerous. And as a result, there were a lot of accidents we saw along the road. Take a look at some of this video we got from earlier today. Our photographer, Ken Mellick, shooting this of a garbage truck that got into an accident with another car. We suspect that that accident was probably a really bad one based on the fact that uh, police had uh, an entire road closed up there in Windsor on, I believe, 305 was the name of that road. It was bad up there. Temperature was in the 20s. People were trying as best as they could to be able to get rid of all of the snow that was there. And they probably got two or three inches of snow that packed down significantly. Uh, here in Waterbury, where we are right now, there's maybe an inch or so of snow that it then rained and poured on for the first time all day long, actually, here in Waterbury. Thankfully, the temperature has gone slightly above freezing, which is a good thing for now. Problem is, like Fred's been talking about, it will drop back down below freezing again overnight tonight, and it will be really treacherous. We're going to head up towards Hartford to show you what the conditions are like over there where it is below freezing and likely more dangerous.